what's going on everyone? Craig here and welcome back to a brand new episode of our Minecraft Xbox One Survival. Hope you guys are having a great day and we're super excited for an awesome new episode of this series. So I haven't done an episode for a few days, sorry I've just been super busy trying to get my schedule um, all together. But uh, I finished up all my schooling so um, now I'm done with that. Now I got summer to look forward to, hopefully make some awesome videos for you guys. I have so many cool ideas and so many thoughts about them, I just need to get some time now made uh, to be able to do all that, you know what I mean? So, that's kind of where I'm at right now. Um, but yeah, so, what I was planning on doing in this episode is trying to get even more cobblestone, but I wanted to do it more of, like, in a fun way, rather than just going to our um, cobblestone, like, farm and just getting, like, an un unlimited amount, but it's kind of boring to watch that, you know what I mean? So, um... I've actually found a perfect spot to go do that at. So that's what we're going to be doing today for the build that we're going to be creating very, very soon. I might do it off camera. I've mentioned this a few times now, um, but it is a very big build. So it'll take me a while. I've never done it before. So hopefully it'll work on the console version. I think it will, but I'm not too sure. So we got to, like, it'll be annoying if it doesn't work and I uh, and I build it all because it'll, it'll like, take a long time to build, especially like not in creative, like in a survival mode, it takes a while. So I'll figure that out. Um, but yeah, so other than that, our levels are only five, so not looking too good. I need to, uh, repair a bunch of this armor. Uh, the helmet, even the legs and the boots are pretty, pretty low. And then obviously the sword and the pickaxe are pretty low as well. So not looking too good. Um, our silk touch pickaxe though is fine. So that's, that's at least we got that one. That's, uh, perfect. So yeah, that's that. I also need to make a new chest plate, um, and enchant that eventually as well. But, yeah, all right. Did I hear a door close? Oi, it's raining. <laughs> I thought I heard a door close, but I don't really have, like, any doors at my house. So I was like, what is going on? I have no idea. Yes, hello, cats. How are you doing? I haven't really talked with you guys for a while. Oh, and one cat. I need to get more cats. So I don't know what happened to the other ones. Loads of dogs here. Um, all right, so what are we going to be doing right now? we got to go down and get to the spot where we're going to be getting a lot of this cobblestone. But I need to make probably even another pickaxe you know what I mean because we'll need a bunch um, I don't want I don't know I, I don't think I want to use my diamond pickaxe um, like make a diamond pickaxe because it'll I don't know just use up my diamonds obviously so don't really feel like doing that I'll make a couple more um, and there we go that should be pretty good we also got some food so yeah we're not looking too bad at all all right good stuff good stuff so this spot where I was hoping to kind of make a little bit of a mining area um, and be able to get a bunch of this cobblestone is over here. Hello, Iron Golem. So I was kind of mentioning this before. I'm, I'm going to, I think, make this uh, all the way, go all the way down to bedrock and then just have it be a strip mine for us. Maybe it'll lead to some other cool new caves. <clears throat> um, so yeah, that's kind of the plan. And it goes down pretty deep. So uh, I already started it. That's why it's already going down here pretty deep. But it'll take a long time all, to get all the way to bedrock just because we're in an extreme hills biome. So we're really, really high up right now. So that's why it's going to take really, a really long time. And I also kind of hit like a dead end, not dead end, but opening here, um, which is annoying because I don't know how I'm going to really do this. I have to like build it kind of so I can get down there, but you'll see what I mean. So I have to like do this to be able to keep the staircase going. If you see what I'm saying here. Um, I'll try it, but I don't know. But I might want to keep this open just so I can use this as like a another walkway, but I don't know if that's really possible. It's all good. It's all good. Let's do this, and then we can just basically keep going from here. Okay, cool. Good stuff. So, yeah, so we hit just kind of the other one of the other parts of this Extreme Hills biome that we're in. Um, basically, it's just a small cave system. There's really nothing much here um, other than just it opens up to the outside. So we can connect this to our house somehow. I don't know what I'd really keep down here, but... Um, we could do something maybe cool with this. I also need to work out how I'm going to make the uh, zombie villager, or when once we turn into normal villagers, the just the normal villager um, like area at back at the uh, zombie um, spawner. So I'm gonna make just keep all my villagers there. It's kind of a risky spot because if the zombies attack them or even just touch them, they'll turn back into zombie villagers. So that's not good. So hopefully that doesn't happen. But I'll try to keep it like. Try to make it secure so zombies can't do that. I know their mobs can get in there and blow anything up. So uh, I'll try to work on that as well. I kind of have a, a, a small design in my head how I'm going to work that out. But I'll figure that out. Don't worry about that. I want to get a load of villagers from that zombie 
um, spawner, so we don't have to like minecart them all the way around the map. I mean, we still could do that, but it just takes a really, really long time. Um, I don't know why I didn't think of the getting the villagers from the the spawner sooner. Like that would have been a much uh, wiser thing to do. But let's keep going and see if we can find any cool cave systems. Um, but I don't know, know what level we're on. Do we have our map? Yes, we do. We can check out uh, what level we're on right now. So we are at Y56, so actually very, very high still. Um, that probably just means we're just um, like starting to mine down below the surface. <clears throat> because I think we're still kind of in the Extreme Hills uh, biome setting right now. So, yeah, we it's really cool. Like, I, I really like this this biome to build houses in. Um, I don't know. I just I really, really like it. It's really cool. Um, like mountain houses and stuff. I just, I, I've never really done that before, but I really like how the design of ours has turned out so far because we can look over so much area. And imagine if this was like an, an SMP uh, series or server, then we'd be able to see if anyone was trying to attack us like much sooner. Like we could build a big giant wall. Like it could be really, really cool if it was an SMP series, but still it's cool nonetheless. I still really, really like it. Probably would not have been able to do a bunch of the builds that we have done if it would have been an SMP. So, um, SMP just stands for survival multiplayer if you guys are wondering about that. Let's keep going though. Look how far though. <laughs> wow, it goes really, really high. That's crazy. Crazy, crazy. I might put stair, like actual stairs in here so we can just kind of run up a little bit faster. But it would take a while to do that. Take a while to make, like use a lot of resources up. So, I don't know if that's going to happen or not. Got some coal, okay. Take some XP from that. Good stuff, good stuff. Another thing I haven't really done for a while is going to the nether. Um, I don't know, just haven't had the need to. and I don't even think I've set my nether, nether portal up again um, from when I had to take it down. So um, I, know, I know the location f for where it's going to be at, but I just don't know why I haven't really had the need to go in it. So maybe we'll go in there uh, soon. I don't know. I'll have to set it up again so we'll get a different spawn than last time. But it can't be too different. Like, we're not changing... <laughs> the location of it terribly much. Ooh, is this... Whoa. Holy cow. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. We just found a huge, huge cave system. Maybe. At least a huge ravine, I should say. This is crazy. I was actually not expecting to find this. How low are we? 41. Okay, that's still pretty high, so... This won't be very good if it doesn't lead anywhere else. I might try to cap this lava source. Um, it would probably be the smartest thing to do. Hopefully I don't get shot off by a skeleton or anything like that. Alright, that should slowly disappear now. There's more lava over there. I'll lose the light source, but it's fine. Wow, this is insane! This is absolutely insane. I did not, not think we'd find this. Alright, so we're going to wait for this to disappear for a second. Actually, we could just go down. I don't know. It'll be hard to get back up here, though. We'll put a torch right here to show that's, like, where we came in at, I guess. We'll open this up as well. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Now, how am I going to get down? Or just do that. Okay, I missed the, missed the thing I was trying to grab onto, but okay, okay. All right. Wow, this is crazy. Um, we'll grab this. Ooh, this could be good. Got a zombie here. Hello, zombie. How are you doing today, sir? Do I have a water bucket? Yes, I do. Good stuff. Always got to come prepared when, you, when you're when you down here. Oh, shoot. Hey, get off me. I don't have any of my diamond stuff, so we're going to have to actually be careful of who's attacking me down here. At least we have a lot of food. Uh, I might grab some of this iron as well just so we can cook it up later. Um, it's never a bad thing to do. Uh, I don't want this lava to hit me. I think we're okay. All right, thank you, thank you. Um, grab some more of this right here. So yeah, this is just to get refill my iron because I mean I did use some to make the pickaxes and other stuff, other armor. I think we're yeah we don't even have a helmet now, so we could make a helmet. Do we have wood? Wow, we don't even have wood. <laughs> Good stuff. Wow, I was not really expecting to go mining on this episode. Like it was more of just getting cobblestone. So I mean, I, we could mine a little bit, I guess. We're not terribly far from the house, which is a good thing. Uh, but this is not like ideal mining areas because it's just so high. Um, let's go check out what's over here. Then we'll kind of hit back up that area over there. Like it goes, it's interesting. It goes kind of low in certain spots, but it doesn't like lead to any other cave systems. This lava is going to be hard. 
Um, can I just cap this? Thank you. Put that there. Um, hmm. Interesting, interesting. This might be a dead end. Wouldn't be surprised if it is. It's just a really weird mine, like a really weird uh, ravine layout. I don't know. Hey, gold. I'll take it. Oh, no way. I see. Lo Whoa. Holy cow. Another ravine. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, so we're finding gold now. That's a really good sign. Um, but I just can't believe, like, this is just, look, like, think about it. It's just right below our house. We're going to go that way in a second. I'm just going to see if there's anything else to hit up over here. It's just a block, okay? It's really dark there for some reason. Um, this just connects. Let's see what this is all about. All right, nothing. Good. <laughs> see lots of bats down here. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Weird water source. That leads back up. Okay. Um, let's go see what's up here, I guess. I'm really not sure what to find now. Whoa, whoa! Just a random room up there. That's weird. Just a, like there's nothing else even up there. I don't think. Is there anything in here? I don't think there's anything in there either. Okay, whatever. That was really weird. <laughs> not going this way, I guess. Um. Okay, so let's go back this way where we found this huge ravine. Like this is another ravine. Like another kind of ravine layout that we've seen before, where they. There's just two ravines, like, right next to each other. It's very, very strange. Like, one's much higher than the other, but very weird. I'm going to move my torches so I don't have to click constantly between them. There we go. All right, so don't really know the best way to get down here. I see a creeper down there. It's not good. Maybe just going down this way. Probably won't be able to find the path back to our house, so I'll probably just have to mine back up. But it's better than nothing, I guess. At least we know we'll, we'll come up close to our house. Grab some of this coal. Oh, shoot. I don't know if we're... Where did that guy shoot me from? I don't know if we're running low on coal or not at our house. I don't think we are. I think we have a lot in our big chest. Um, but might as well grab some just for a little bit of XP as well. Never hurts. Never hurts. <clears throat> Let's get all this. Thank you. Thank you. So let me know what you guys are up to. Hope you guys are uh, all uh, in summer right now. Enjoying your summer break unless you guys go year round or um, maybe some of you guys aren't out for uh, school for summer yet. I don't know. I don't know. So let me know how that's all going. Um, ooh, more gold. Good stuff. Uh, wow, emeralds. Yes, that is one reason why um, I forgot to kind of mention this before. That's one reason why I wanted to kind of do this mining thing in Extreme Hills biome just because the chance we can find emeralds. Oi, that was dumb. That was dumb. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, it's a free cobblestone though. I'll take that. Like I could have died there. Like my armor sucks, so I that could have been bad. All right, get some more of this. So yeah, emeralds. That's so perfect. Like oh man, oi! I wish I had my oh, shoot. I wish I had my fortune pickaxe now. I should have brought it. I didn't know we'd be doing this. Like oh my gosh. Uh, shoot, 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 dudes. I really wish I had my fortune pickaxe now. Oi. Should have brought at least an E-chest. I should put all, a lot of that stuff in an E-chest. Because I, I think I probably will find diamonds down here. Like, this is d definitely a diamond area. I don't care if I get the lapis without fortune. Because we have so much lapis as it is. So, is this emerald... Is this only one? Yeah, it looks like it. They're pretty rare to find in more than stacks of one anyway. Um, okay, so... Oh, this is annoying. Um, I'm going to get my text document out on my other monitor right here. I do apologize for this, but this is kind of too good to pass up. So I'm going to name this uh, cave, uh, cave system need um, fortune pick. And then I'm going to put the coordinates down. Um, and luckily we do have our map. If we didn't have our map, we'd be absolutely screwed. Uh, so, what is that? Is that... Why is my map... Why is my map doing that? You see that, like, uh, over the first coordinate, there's, like, a little circle? I think that's a 7 <laughs> over X. Um, so, 6... I think my map's just loading in weird. 679 and then negative 1648. 
And if you just go there, if we just dig straight down, we'll hit this uh, spot and it'll be perfect. So I'll save that. All right. Do apologize about that, but just really don't. I mean, I either have a chance of getting one emerald or four. And four emeralds, like, that's really awesome. Like, that's why, and especially since the cave system we're in right now, I bet you will find diamonds in it. I don't know. I can't guarantee, but I, I have a strong, uh, strong that thought that we could find diamonds down here. More lapis. Like, I could even use the fortune for the lapis. Well, like I said, I just have so much lapis as it is that um, it's fine. It's fine. Let's just connect up top. Looks like it. Ooh, more lapis. Wow. There's so much. Like, usually lapis is pretty rare. I'm surprised we're finding this much. Um, is there more? Wow, there is. Jeez. It's awesome. Sadly, this is not Minecraft 1.8, so it doesn't have any benefit um, to enchanting on here. Um, and the enchanting system is, like, the, the annoying one. Um, so, won't really be any use to us, but it's still just a cool block nonetheless. Cool block to have. Um, okay, let's get back up here. We also can find more emeralds, which would be absolutely awesome. All right, this is, oh my gosh, it's too big to explore. Actually, it's too big to explore. Seriously, look at this. It just doesn't stop. Ugh, I say that like it's a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. It's just, I don't know. Whenever I run into these cave systems, I never can get out of them, it seems like. I always get sucked in and get addicted to going and exploring. Like, hopefully I'm not missing stuff. I really hope I'm not missing anything. This gravel, like, chunk is weird. No way! More emeralds! What is life? What is this? Insanity. More freaking emeralds. Please tell me it's more than one. Uh, see, I told you, like, you rarely find emeralds more than in a patch of, like, one. Um, unless you're just pretty lucky. Alright, so, I'm gonna put this as an emerald just location, because I probably won't go this way again. Um, I know I'm like kind of going all out for this, but I just don't want to lose these emerald. Uh, I'll just say one. Um, okay, so what's the coordinates for this? Oh, I almost minded my mistake. Uh, six is that six? Yeah, six sixteen. Um, and then the Z is negative sixteen forty nine. Negative sixteen forty nine. Okay, good stuff. Got that saved. All right. Um. Yeah, so we're going to avoid that for now. This is probably getting too high. I don't know the, the spawn, um, like what levels emeralds spawn at. Um, I'm really not too sure. Like, we're at 19. That's pretty low, actually. So maybe they don't have a certain spawn limit. It's just, it's just a, as long as you're in Extreme Hills biomes, you can find them. Not too sure, though. I really don't know. Like, I've never really messed with emeralds an insane amount. This is the first series, like, I've really kind of found emeralds a lot and, and messed with them more with the villager trades, you know what I mean? Um, other than that, I've never really done it, which is cool, I guess. Learning new things uh, every time I play Minecraft, which is awesome. Let's get up here a little bit. Um, I'll go this way. I just don't want to... Oh, yeah, there's more lapis here. Collect all this. Thank you. I don't want to make these episodes too long, so I have a lot to kind of catch up on. Um, so we'll probably see like around 20-minute episodes, maybe. I don't know. It just depends. All right, and this connects us back to here. So perfect spot. Um, is there? How do I get in here again? Because I might try to go home if I can. Uh, it was up here, and then oh yes, it was up here. Okay, perfect. I kind of know where I'm going now. And then it was back here, and then you have to go in the ravine. So I, I'll try to do this off camera. Just go back to the house, um, get the fortune pick, maybe get some levels to try to repair it. Um, unless I can repair it once now, and then come back down here. Where's the opening? It's right over here. Perfect, perfect. And then uh, try to get back down here as quickly as possible, and then we'll just start down here next episode. I was really not planning on doing a mining mission because I want to do this build that I've been talking about, but this is almost too good to uh, pass up, so it's got to be done. But I do hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of our Minecraft Xbox One Survival. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, please Subscribe, it helps other tunnels. Follow me on Twitter to be the first to know when I release a new video. Definitely check out the playlist down below if you missed any episodes in the past. And yeah, that's gonna be it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Until next time, guys, have a great day, and I'll see you on the next episode.